This one is for the back end quarterbacks, not to be confused with the backseat drivers. Taking care of your training and content creation teams is just as vital as taking care of your trainees. So this video will be a hit with your learning and training departments. Go ahead and share it with them now. We're confident they'll love it. For many years now, the standard in the learning industry has been to work with a subject matter expert through the design and scripting of content, review, change, edit, and repeat. Then send it off to a third party content developer to build it and a number of content tools. Publish it, review, edit, repeat. Finally, package it all up, making sure that all the SCORM details are correct. Load it to the LMS, test, hope all the content is correct. Because if there's a change to be made, you need to go back through a number of steps and repeat. Wouldn't it be nice to simply empower your subject matter experts and content teams to publish new material in-house, at their desks, with a click of a few buttons? Just like the marketing team does when posting a blog. That's doing digital learning differently, and that's exactly how we do it at SparkLearn. With our built-in content management system, your teams can now create, review, and publish content directly in the online content creation interface. One of the goals of SparkLearn is to make learning more user-friendly for not only your workforce, but for your content teams. So we have created ways for them to get their content out quicker while still maintaining great design and review processes. I mentioned marketing having it easy when creating a blog within a framework of your website. Here's how the same principle works in SparkLearn. Insert your text, list, bullets, formatting, images, video, and audio, and then live preview. Yeah, that's right, I said live preview. You have the ability to see what your content will look like right in the platform. So no more publish, upload, review, edit, repeat. Need to get feedback from others or have user-generated content? You can allow for the creation and then send it off for review and allow other subject matter experts to make edits as well. We're not just limited to blog style postings. You could also add in tips and review cards to highlight content that learners should be focused on more specifically. And since we are a learning platform and not just a blog, you can also build quizzes, including pre-quizzes that feed into our adaptive engine, and test to check your user's understanding. Tests can have scoring, percentages set, and of course all of this is tracked via XAPI for record keeping and review. If you have a series of content pieces and want to group them into logical sections, you can also create courses. These are ordered groups of all the content above that are presented to the user in a way that the learner can flow through as recommended or in whatever order suits them. We mentioned images before. One thing that can slow down your workflows is finding quality images. We know this, so we've included with each instance of SparkLearn access to over 1 million high quality unsplash images that are free to use and can be inserted in 30 seconds or less. Yes, that is not a mistake, I said under 30 seconds or less. Do you have videos on YouTube, Vimeo, or other hosting platforms? No problem. Insert your linked videos into articles, build information around them, and get them out to your learners. SparkLearn can also reference external information, links to websites, your intranet, etc., as well as uploading of documents, PDFs, and more. And don't worry, if you have legacy content or need more interaction, SparkLearn can handle uploads of all your XAPI content from a wide variety of popular development tools. And finally, we can connect through our rich API implementations to other systems that you have, whether an existing legacy LMS or one of your other business intelligence tools. If you'd like to see more about how we do content creation differently, check us out at sparklearn.com.